Welcome, this is the energy vibration reading for it. The Scorpion, it's just Sun, Moon, and Horizon. This is the year 2018. And I want to say thank you for your support, your likes, and shares. Thank you for the wonderful, wonderful support that you have been giving to me. I am so grateful. Um, this year of 2018 is going to be a wonderful, positive year for you guys. It is a year of wonderful surprises, especially um, January. You begin the year in, with wonderful, wonderful, successful things. January is a good month to start out things and you end the year in December with wonderful, positive energies. I want to thank you so much. I'm wishing you guys a wonderful, positive year ending and a new beginning for the year 2018. And remember, this is a general reading. If you would like to have a personal reading, please connect with me for the year, the, the um, year reading for you, Scorpions, and then you get a personal reading personalized reading for yourself if you'd also like to have three months reading um or an every month the energy vibration you can also order that on um the channel please remember to like and share these videos please remember to subscribe if this is your first time thank you so much for being here and i think my microphone Thank you so much for being here and thank you for supporting my channel in all the way that you have to do. This is wonderful and this is positive and this is going to be good. So, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, please write this down. January is going to be a wonderful month. Um, April is going to be a wonderful month. Um, you have the energy. Um, the second quarter is going to be good for you guys. It's all about love in the second quarter. As we look at the third quarter, which is uh, um, July until September. September is going to be a wonderful month for you. I see that you water sign people are having September as a good time. So um, July and September is going to be good. Justice comes in, which can be good and work out in a positive energy for you guys. And we have the energy of the chariot, which is victory and success over your enemies and your and, and the devil, victory and success against the devil and the energy of wonderful surprise money. Um, all that you need in your materialistic world you are going to see that coming in in the second half of the year and this is going to be wonderful for so september it is it, the energies have changed because september was like clearing out but for you guys september is uh, bringing in money uh, a lot of money a lot of um you know whatever you need in your materialistic world money car houses um name it you know looks is coming in in the last period of the year and this is going to be very good the first period is a lot of good energies for you guys because this this year is um a really positive year for you guys because it's, it's a good year because what is happening is that and a lot of and uh, transition a lot of wonderful situations are coming out in your life and this is um, extremely positive because there is a lot of situation that is happening that is going to be um, keeping this energy very positive and very good for you so you know whatever has a transpire in your life whatever has happened in your life you know it's going to be positive because most of you are going to be going out on new journeys and new situation in your life so this is going to be positive the number is the number three number 21 um number 17 number eight number 19 number 10 and number seven so again number three number 21 number 17 number eight and number two number two number seven and number 19 and number 10 okay so this is going to be so let's move into your reading and let's see what is happening because it's a clear cut reading it's very good it's positive yes whatever you're thinking about doing go ahead in january and do it because it's going to be very very positive um this is going to be a wonderful positive time in your life you're going to realize that good positive situations are coming out in your life this is going to be extremely positive so um 
you are going to be realizing and understanding that your life is about to change in this year this year for you guys is a very lucky year for you scorpion extremely extremely lucky year and there's a lot of supporting energies for you guys in this year um february is going to be a wonderful month february is going to bring in you are going to be bringing in wonderful new experience in your life but yet still new positive energies coming up this is going to be wonderful exciting things that will be happening in your life and this is going to be good so whatever is happening um january and february is a lucky lucky month in march there is going to be a transformation and this transformation is going to come in but whatever is happening with this transformation is a good transformation because it's as if your luck has changed and this is going to be bringing um, this year is going to be bringing a whole lot of new stuff so things needs to end so that new things come in and that is what you're going to be seeing in March as we look at April and not a wonderful energy because whatever that ends um, luck came out in April for you so this is wonderful this is positive this is where you kind of balance out yourself and kind of understand how you are going to be moving forward and how positive energies are going to be coming at you in the month of May you are going to be having a situation with the energy of the lovers and you're going to be wondering um, and you and some of you are going to be uh, meeting up on new love partners and this is going to be good some people are going to realize that relationship that they're in they're going to be receiving information about a relationship you have been in or the relationship that you are in some of you are going to decide to move on and go on a new journey as we look forward we have in the month of June a wonderful energy where you have the energy of breakthroughs coming through information coming through this is good whatever is these new breakthroughs and information is going to take you on a new journey so this is going to be wonderful and positive so a lot of people will be getting invitation for new work and that sort of a thing uh, or you're going to travel or you're going to go on a vacation or you are going to go somewhere to meet someone and new love in your life and this is going to be positive so the first half of the year is a very 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 completely positive things because whatever is coming through for um, January is one of those lucky lucky month for you guys and um, um, the second quarter is extremely lucky especially in love and especially in business partner and connection with other people as we look at July is another wonderful wonderful month for you um, scorpions because whatever is happening whatever new journey that you're going on you're going to see that you have made the rise to the right the correct choice in July um, in June and um, whatever information you got in June you made a choice and a decision to move forward and change your part and this is going to be good because in July you have the energy of the eye princess and this is positive and very 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 good and it's going to lead you to something which is wonderful August is a good month but be aware the deep the devil is in the details so whatever is coming up whatever is coming at you be aware because the devil is in the details so be aware of this if you're working with fire sign people be aware of this because there could be a catch to something so you need to understand and realize that but in um, in other words there is great it's going to be a good time and a positive uh, situation that is coming out as we move forward we're seeing the energy vibration of the Empress in September this is good a lot of you are going to receive a lot of money a lot of financial abundance a lot of prom, uh, prosperity coming in in the month of September this is going to be good because this is going to have to do with materialistic things it can be pregnancy and uh, new kids born in, in September I'm seeing this in other energies for other signs also so this is going to be good this is a balance uh, month September is balanced because the energy of the herd comes in to balance out situations so it is a very very promising um, um, three months from uh, July to September so not to worry positive things are coming up as we look at the energy vibration for um, 
um, October October you have the energy of justice and with this energy of justice there are situation that is going to happen in your life whatever injustice that they were good things it is balancing out and it depends as always I said it depends on who you are and what energy vibration you work on because if you work on a low energy vibration this is what is going to be happening for you guys if you work on a high energy vibration then it is going to be positive as we move on um because september october um is powerful and it's good whatever that was injustice whatever injustice and that sort of a thing it's going to be working out in your favor because you're going to have a victorious success in the month of november november is going to bring you a huge victory and success a success that you weren't seeing coming a victory that you never saw coming so it depends again on who you are and what is your energy vibration how do you look at things are you positive or are you just trying to get on without and, and that sort of a thing so this is what is going to be working out are things going to work out in your favor or are they going to work against you so this is what we need to look at and it's going to be positive in november and again december is going to be fantastic yeah. so you begin the year with an earth sign you end the year with a fire sign this fire sign is passion everything that you have always wanted everything that you always needed you are happy you are ecstatic blessing um but you're you know the the um bliss joy happiness is for you and this is good because the end of the year is going to connect you with someone who is an earth sign and this is going to be powerful because it, it is coming up as a mother figure so some of you who your parents are Taurus Virgo or Capricorn this is going to be powerful because you're ending the year with a positive note with this person you're going to be extremely happy you're going to feel blissful you're going to feel that this is what I've always wanted and it is going to come continue like this for the rest of your life so this is wonderful a good 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 positive reading you 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 scorpion got very very nice reading good readings so in the first half of the year it's more with relationship in the second half it is more with your financial situation and you you are victorious uh, um, over a lot of situation and the energy of uh, um, connecting with your parents this is so good because um, for the people whose parents are um, very um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn you're going to be uh, connecting with them and you're going to be so extremely happy as we move forward this is a year of new beginnings and new start for you guys so congratulations and this is going to be good because you're going to begin the year with these positive energies of the hurt the, um, the world and you're ending the year with the energy of the Sun which is positive whatever you decide to do in these two months go ahead and do it you are on a part of newness you are breaking out you're going on new journeys you're connecting with yourself you're making transformation and you have a new start so this is going to be a very positive wonderful year so congratulations again you scorpions I so love you guys I honestly so love you guys um, please so whatever um, you or you know you have what always wanted in your life this is going to be happening this is the year for you guys and it is the uh, the energy of justice and this is wonderful because whatever that has transpired in your life before wonderful positive energies are coming back to you and this in tenfold let's look at the zodiac sign you're going to be connecting with the Aries people and the Scorpions. so this is good for you Sun sign people so if you were born in the day if you were born in the day if you were born between the hours of 6 um, 12 a.m. and 6 p.m. and you're a Sun sign person you are going to be connecting with the Aries and the Scorpion so in relationships you're going to be meeting the Aries, Aries and the Scorpion people it's not good to go in the same in relationship with people of the same sign because it's it, it never it, it never ends well so be aware of this so 
for you scar sun signs scorpions you're going to have the Aries, the Aries and the scorpion coming in and this is going to be positive some of you are going to be connecting it might look like a nice relationship and begin out as a nice relationship but it's not always going to end good okay let's look at the people who were born 6 p.m. till 12 a.m. and let's look and see what is happening for you guys you have to deal with the Sagittarians and the air the Aquarians the Sagittarians and the Aquarians so this is going to be good this is going to be powerful whatever the situation is happening in your life you people um, who were born in the night have to deal with the Sagittarians and the Aquarians which is not so bad but it's as if you're clearing certain comments that you need to clear with these people and um, the, the, the Sagittarians can be very good for you I would you know if you're going in a relationship choose the Sagittarians because they're much better for you than the Aquarians because water and hair don't always match up very well water and air people don't always match up very good but the Sagittarians um, are coming in and they are good partnerships business partnership especially and um, the uh, Aquarians or you know people who are going to open up this psychic part of you they're coming in like in the last part of the year or so you know it could be the reverse section of uh, um, what is coming in I'm using the Ascension card and also always because we're going through Ascension I'm using the energy vibration of to see um, who which one of the Ascendants Masters will be helping you the mat my energy this is good so for you scorpions this is a good good energy to to have and this energy is powerful whenever things are array in your life call upon the Mahatma energies I now invoke the Mahatma energies to flow through me and surrounds me. I'm asking it to, to seal all doors and windows in my house. I'm calling up for it to be in my car, my vehicles, and all in my bed, in my house, cleanse the energy and to be in my house of all times. It is so and it will be. It will be. In the golden age, or the golden age of Atlantis many great souls place some of their energies as well as the Christ Buddha light and that of the 12 rays into the sacred pool to create a higher energy frequency groups and consciousness people could draw from this sacred pool to enhance themselves and their projects so if you are about to begin a project bless it met the Mahatma energy and this is going to work for you this golden white ascension flame the Mahatma energy is once more available and you are invited to draw it through the chakra system into the hurt this will raise your frequency and help the planet um, for you will leave golden footsteps wherever you go send it to others to accelerate their ascension so this is wonderful so you can always use this energy if you feel as if you're in a negative situation if you feel as if people and things are working against you or with you you can call up and invoke so let's do that again I invoke the Mahakma energy to flow through me and surround me it is so and it will be you need to say this always three times I now invoke the Mahatma energy to flow through me and surround me it is so and it will be I now invoke the Mahatma energy to flow through me and surround me it is so and it will be that is the affirmation please write this down use this energy and this affirmation in the year 2000 and um, octane and you will see mighty full changes and situation clearing up in your life so that is a good energy to have 
I love working with the Mahatma energy because it's a positive positive energy just um, it brings the golden white flame of ascension call upon Serasmus Bay to bring in these ascensions these energies and ask them to stay with you all the time ask them to always walk with you surround you and help you to vibrate and move forward in your life okay all right let's look we're using the Aztec cards also so let's see what energies are coming up for you ah, another reverse card I'm not sure people what is going on but in this card deck and this is a powerful deck um, because it is the Aztec yeah the Aztec Torah deck it is new it just just came out I've been watching out for it I finally have it because I wanted it for the year reading but this is powerful because most if you go back and look at the rest of the reading most of these energies are in the reverse form really 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 in the reverse form so let's see what is happening for this energy um, and it is the energy of the treasure the treasure two of keys the treasure two of keys in reverse because it's used the scroll the treasures the rose and it is in reverse so let's see and go back and see what is happening why the two of keys is in reverse and don't be alarmed because most of the reverse energies i realize in this card deck is very very positive so the treasures is in the reverse in this exciting in this exciting reversal the lid on the um on the the chest with the treasures of light has fallen open some distinguished disruption event may have made you feel vulnerable but you haven't defined yourself through loss you have unveiled your spirit and recognize the wealth of light and power inside you the immediate um, future fills with manifest opportunities as well as new and abundance offering from the universe that are coming to you now so isn't this wonderful because this is I hadn't gone deeper in this deck and I really wanted this deck for the, the 2018 year reading and I finally get it because I saw it um, I think from in the beginning of this year that it was coming out and I've ordered it from August and I finally got it in November this is just so much a positive energy because it is in reverse and it is you know it is wonderful because what it's saying is that if the treasure chest has fallen open some the disruptive event Event may have made you feel vulnerable but you haven't defined yourself through loss you have unveiled your spirit and recognize the wealth of light and power inside you the immediate future fills with manifesting uh, opportunities as well as new and abundant offering from the universe that are coming to you now isn't this wonderful yes it is yes it is yes it is you scorpion this is so wonderful it is the perfect perfect reading um, the perfect perfect card for your reading because it's you know whatever has fallen out of your treasure chest you're moving on up on in a new journey and a new part in your life so okay let's look and see what the conscious spirit is saying for you let's look and see what is the conscious spirit saying for you oh my gosh spirits awaken I embrace my soul purpose and align all aspects of my life to its full this is wonderful isn't it yes it is because 
what is happening is that you are now you have awakened your spirit the eye princess is also here you have ended something and you have aligned it your spirit you have looked within for your true light and now you have aligned your spirit and look at that beautiful radiance of light coming down at you and you're going to be blessed and be positive in this year so this is wonderful this is a wonderful messages for you guys we're moving out to the last and final card for the angels of abundancy we're moving out for the last and final card for the scorpions for the year 2018 let's see what is happening for you scorpions in the year 2018 and it says god is your source god is your source and everything you need is supplied by the infinity source of God and your uh, and your faith opens the door to receive in God there is no lack or limitation rather there is plenty of abundance for all to share so whenever you are in a stage of want come back to this year reading listen to this read this card and know that your source is from source creator and no other no one can block your source no one can block your manifestation of uh, your abundancy to come in because it is showing here you begin the year on a good point you end the year this year is a year that you are about to have positive positive situation happening in your life so ladies and gentlemen boys and girls I am going to wish you a wonderful positive year I want to say to you guys I love you so much um, you are the light of my world please remember to listen to your Sun moon and rising sign and please 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 um, share this video thumbs up like and shares and I'm saying to each and every person thank you for your support and please if you'd like to donate it is nice to donate something to this channel because I'm trying to reach a lot of people and I am trying to help also people who are unable to purchase a reading so whatever you can do to donate you can donate any amount of money to donate button is there please subscribe and please listen to your sun moon and rising sign if you'd like to have a personalized reading go to the link below this video and connect with me via the website or via clarity i really really prefer via the website if it's something that is very important you can go through clarity but as you connect with me via the website a year read it is very good it's good for people um to see what is going to happen in your year forecast okay the year to come for you guys so i want to say to each and every person thank you for being here Thank you for being back. Please like, share these videos. Namaste till next year.